types of entropy and what do you mean by entropy and the, what are the formula used in entropy and this topic holds approximately 16 to 18 marks in all the diagnostic exams and even this is also important in respect of the gate exam okay so in so in the previous lecture i explain about the all types of entropy entropy and formula used in entropy okay this all i explain in previous lecture see see this all i explain in previous lecture okay now in this lecture i am going to explain one of the best examples okay and this is the question which is asked in most of the universities so please see it carefully this is pxy and we have to find all the entropy okay we have to find all the entropy all the entropy means uh, like uh, joint entropy conditional entropy mutual entropy and uh, each have to each have two two sections okay so let's see so here i am going to find px1 px2 px3 and px4 px5 so let me tell what is px1 what is px2 px1 is nothing but addition of all the element of row 1 okay px2 is nothing but addition of all the element of row 2 same way px3 px4 px5 okay now let me tell what is py1 py1 is nothing but addition of all the elements of first column and then py2 is nothing but addition of all the element of second column let's see here proof this is 0 0.500 0 0. after adding what i will get y1 is equal to 0 0.25 see here y1 is equal to 0. 0 0.35 sorry by fault here see here this is 0 0.1 by fault i have not written 0 0.1 i have written 0. Point, i have written 0 okay so i'm extremely sorry for that here it is 0 0.1 okay everyone here right okay 0 0.1 because see here also px2 is equal to 0 0.1 0 0.3 is equal to 0 0.4 see here 0 0.3 and 0 0.1 is equal to 0 0.4 px2 okay so py1 py2 py3 and py4 now now let's see what is px divided by y it is equal to pxy upon py okay so what you have to do we are going to find p with respect to y okay so pxy take all the elements of all the elements of pxy and then divide with the py1 y2 y3 and y4 okay you have to divide with py1 this all element all the element of first column and all the element of second column with the y2 py2 and divide all the elements of third column with py3 let's see one example okay suppose here uh, pxy is 0 0.25 okay and py1 is equal to 0 0.35 so 0 0.25 divided by 0 0.35 is equal to 5 by 7 okay and then see this one 0 0.1 here 0 0.1 is there in pxy see here 0 0.1 i told you here it is not 0 it is 0 0.1 okay so 0 0.1 divide by divide by what 0 0.35 with py1 okay so i will get 2 by 7 same way this all the elements of uh, of column 2 you have to divide with py2 and this py3 and py4 okay now same way you will get p p divided by x is equal to pxy or divided by px okay so this is called conditional probability okay p with respect to x okay so here take every element and divide the rows all the elements of first row with the px1 all the elements of second row with px2 all the elements of third rows divide with px3 okay so our first element is 0 0.25 and px1 is 0 0.25 see see this is 0 0.25 okay and uh, px1 is 0 0.25 pxy is 0 0.25 okay so after dividing 0 0.25 divided by 0 0.25 i will get here 1 okay so now let us see questions okay i mean let us see the actual solution entropy which we have to find up to this just we are doing formality only this we all have to do only it's very lengthy questions so hx is equal to i is equal to 1 to 5 okay because this is up to 5 term 1 2 3 4 5 5 rows is there so i is equal to 1 to 5 pxi log pxi okay always use here log with the base 2 okay 
so 0 0.25 log 0 0.25 0 0.4 log 0 0.4 and 0 0.15 log 0 0.15 0 0.05 and log 0 0.5 pxi and pxi means i have five term like px1 px2 px3 and px4 and px5 see here we have are you seeing this one this one this one this one okay so i am finding the hx like this okay 0 0.25 log 0 0.25 0 0.4 log 0 0.4 okay so I will get hx is equal to 2.066 bits per symbol okay same way hy is equal to hy is equal to what y1 log py1 log py py1 okay py2 log py2 yani 0 0.35 log 0 0.35 same way 0 0.35 log base to 0 0.35 same way so after solving I will get hy is equal to 1.856 bits per symbol okay so up to here i find two entropy hx and hy two entropy only still i have to find approx four entropy four or three entropy okay so let's see now i'm going to find hxy hxy what is formula i is equal to one to five and j is equal to one to four pxi yj log pxi yj so this is the very simple you have to take each element of pxy and simply you have to find okay but it's very lengthy it will go it, it, it will go if uh, 5 into 5 matrix then it will go up to 25 if uh, 0 is not present okay so see here 0 0.25 log 0 0.25 0 0.1 log 0 0.1 0 0.3 log base to 0 0.3 after after solving all this i will get here log 0 is like suppose log 0 is not defined so uh, we are not taking here log 0 it is see so hxy is equal to 2.665 bits per symbol this is called joint entropy okay this is joint entropy now let us see about the conditional entropy hx hx divided by y is equal to summation i is equal to 1 to 5 j is equal to 1 to 4 pxi yj log pxi yj here you have to note one point okay see here properly this is the very important formula you have to note here hxy hx by y okay h with respect to y so here also log base to px i by yj means this uh, px i yj we are going to take the term from the actual matrix see here i will take px i px i yj from here okay and i will take uh, px by yj from here p this is this is px by y so i will take element from here px divided by y okay here so say here say here properly hx divided by y yani i will take px i yj from actual question means actual matrix and log px i divided by yj which i found okay so 0 0.25 log 5 by 7 say here log 5 by 7 this one okay so 0 0.25 log 5 by 7 plus 0 0.1 log 2 by 7 same way you can find about all okay so what i got hxy is equal to hx divided by y is equal to 0 0.809 bits per symbol this is called conditional entropy okay x with respect to the y now let's see about this one hy by x hy by x see here pxy this is same again here it is changing okay variable is changing in respect of denominator and numerator so 0 0.25 log 1 0 0.1 log 1 by 4 okay so now i am taking this one from this matrix this matrix okay see this matrix mm -hmm. this is from original matrix which is given in the question and this is from the matrix which we found okay so here hy by x after solving i will get hy by x is equal to 0 0.6 bits per symbol this is called conditional entropy okay now what is mutual entropy mutual entropy is equal to ixy is equal to hx minus hx divided by y hx is 2.066 minus uh, 0.809 okay so 1.157 bits per symbol okay hx by y say it is 0 0.809 say okay so you got it 1.157 bits per symbol this is mutual entropy you can find mutual entropy with other formula also 
which is i x y is equal to h x plus h y minus of h x y say here i told earlier mm -hmm. this formula i x y is equal to h x plus h y minus h x y so you can verify because uh, in that in this question we already found h x h y and h x comma y so you will get here 1.157 bits per symbol so friends uh, this video is very lengthy and uh, if anything i explained wrong so, so i'm extremely sorry for that